fuck is this? Record and please oh. don't mess with that. Oh. I have limited battery life. Wait, you should probably I think it it's on. You can hold it upright. Hold it sideways. Sideways. Sorry, I, meant, I meant like sideways. Oh, you're a dick. Yeah, sorry, I didn't realize this when you had it. And that's Maba. No, Nick's gonna do it all. He's gonna do it. What's up, internet? No. That's how he does his intro. Yeah. I don't really know. What's up, internet? This is Maba. <laughs> and that's Vin. <laughs> Hard <laughs> I, I change it up now. <laughs> Wait, what did you? Did you? Hi, internet. This is Cener on our way to Boston. This What's is, up, internet? I'm driving. That's the black asshole. Yeah, and this is Maba asleep like a baby. Black asshole attack. And that's my phone going off. Oh, it's Susie. We have to stop recording. <laughs> okay. Hi, Internet. Um, this is Cenerk. We're on a bridge. Down. I, really, toll Bruce. I really don't like bridges. He oh. doesn't. And that's... I don't know. I, I don't know. It's probably like my fear of heights or something. And you don't like roller coasters. I don't like roller coasters. And this is Maba. It's the fear of heights. Because now we're going glasses. Up. And this is Vin with his stupid hair. <laughs> yeah. That's true. And more, more to come on our Boston adventure. Seacrest out. All right, we're recording. Woo! Going to PAX. I think we're in New York. Motherfuckers. There's there's Blah over there. I think we're in New York. Black poop Are we shoot. In New York? Black poop shoot attack. Good news, BJ. There's the Maba. I like all Fuck these off. variations on my name. Man. Eh. There's uh. Sleepy baby man. Yeah. There's there's the there's the scenerk. Or, or Diggler. No, big black cocks in my uh, <laughs> B BBC in your butt. Yeah. Uh, this is the, I guess, New York suburby area. New York sucks. Yuck. We haven't. We, we're not in actual New York. Uh, Did you say Newark? New York. We're not in Newark either. You mean, by actual guys. New York, you mean New York City? Yes. Right? Yeah, at the rest New of York, New Everything outside of New York City doesn't exist. New York State is a sham. <laughs> New York State is just shit. Wow. I was gonna let that guy go, but he panicked. You pussy! Fuck that bitch. He's also Asian. Can't drive. Oh, racism. Right there. Oh, stereotyping. Eh, a little bit of both. Yeah. A little bit of both. Gotta let... Got that dome. Got that, got that powder silo. Just full of powder. No peace. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're in New York. I think it's just Dome from Modern Warfare 3. It's a bad map like every other map from Modern Warfare 3. I think if all the license plates are Jersey, that means we're, we're in New York, right? Yes. Yeah. That's how that works. Well, we're still on the Garden State Parkway. Uh, we should be in New York, but uh... <laughs> and then how far from Boston? A lot. If we're in New York. Years of work. We God. still have like like four hours to go. God damn it. Four and a quarter. God damn it, internet. God damn it. Oh, whoa, fuck. Oh, yeah. Quit jerking it so hard, man. Sorry, I was looking at my GPS and suddenly realized I was like on a turn. That asshole's from Connecticut, that asshole in the white car. Connecticut's not a real state. Just hold on your window. Where are we? Hey! Hey, dick! Where the fuck are we? Hey, what's up, Which bitch? Way to pack? What up, bitch? She's from... Jazz. Jersey. Which way to PAX? I want to fight somebody at PAX. You want to fight me at PAX? Nick, or, uh, Nick's going to be fighting everybody at PAX. Yeah, I'm going to Nighthawk everyone at PAX. He's just challenging. All the guys. He's just challenging people at PAX. So if you see him. Jersey. If you see him. I actually arranged to have a booth. It's like a kissing booth, but instead it's a punching booth. It's got boxing gloves and then like a, a glory hole cut out in the bottom. Yeah. You have to fight me, and then either Jersey? way, I rape you afterwards. Right. Well, Whether you win or lose. Depending Jersey? on Jersey. We must be in Jersey. We're still, we're still in Jersey. I'm gonna be really busy and really sweaty and really bloody, and really tired. There you go. And really semeny. All just full of semen. Oh my god. Jersey sun right in my eyes. So much Jersey. Fuck. Wait, are we still in Jersey? New right. York. We're in New York. Oh, now. we found one oh, guy baby. in New York. New, now we're in New York. New, New Yorkers never leave their state, so that's how you know you're in New York. Sud suddenly, all of the New Jersey plates turn into into New York plates. No, they just ram, they just ram them off the road. <laughs> <laughs> we all know Jersey wants to be New York. They'll let us through because we're Pennsylvania. I don't know why they would let us through. Nobody likes Pennsylvania. Uh, hey, Virginia. Um, um wait, wait, fuck wait. that guy. Where are we now? But nobody likes New Jersey. Either. Back in Jersey. I'm pretty sure everybody hates Jersey. I'm pretty. It's just a, it's just like a tr like a triangle of hate. 
Nobody, yeah, nobody. Yeah, Pennsylvania like, hates Jersey. New York hates Pennsylvania. See? Jer Still Jersey. Jersey hates. No, New everybody York. hates Jersey. Everybody hates Jersey. Eh. Why are we It takes like a half hour to get through. We did it wrong. Uh, <laughs> we did it wrong. <laughs> All right, well, we'll update you later, Internet. Fuck yeah, you, bye. We are at a rest stop right now. We're waiting on Maba and Sinerk. Sinerk is my brother, by the way. Uh, his real name is Richard. I don't, it's a long story how he got the name Sinerk. Also known as Big Black Cox and my asshole on uh, League of Legends. Or BBC in my butt, for short. Uh... <laughs> We're just, me and Vin, are, what, uh, did you even get anything? No, I didn't get shit. Nah. I got, this travel vlog is brought to you by Snapple Apple. It's Snapple, but it's apples. Oh, snap. Oh. You're welcome, Snapple. I expect my check within three S weeks. Sponsor. Sponsorship. As, as Tomaskis would say. I also got probably like the worst name chip ever. Eat your vegetables, which... If they got veggies and shit, it says a full serving of vegetables okay. in every ounce. Let me see. Eat your vegetables! I like veggie chips and stuff, so I figure it'll be good. Sour cream and onion, but I think the name's like really long and unwieldy. So. This like, this half of this bag is fucking air. And that's half of every bag. They do it so the chips don't break. Bullshit. But it's more like floppy, because usually like, usually like they're so full of air that if you squeeze it just a tiny bit, it like explodes into a million chips and you know body parts chips. but no it's actually kind of like they didn't totally fill it with air it's it's a little vacuum sealed well, they but they left a little air in there for for like you know cushioning well they totally could have filled it with more chips than those fucking assholes no they always they always they already know how many chips they want to put in the bag and they just make the bag too big mm. so that the chips don't break mm. No, it's really a no, big injustice no, when you get no. when you get like a ninety nine cent bag out of a out of like a vending machine and there's like three chips in there, which has happened. That's fucked up. Are you serious? That's funny. yeah, that's happened to me. That's really funny. And then I you see like pictures of it online and stuff. Also brought to you by McDonald's. Just get shit out of here. Other sponsor. Get this. Sh oh, it's my rearview mirror. I can't really get that shit out of here. McDonald's. It's not just a McDonald's. It's actually a whole bunch of shit. But McDonald's kind of owns the joint. I don't know. Fuck that shit. What's up, internet? We just got to the apartment. Which one do you want? And it's pretty freaking sweet, actually. Wow. Here, look, look what we have. We're trying to figure out rooming situations right now. Take a take a gander. We, we got um, a uh, we got this nice There's table. Enough. We got coming out to the uh, little living room area. There's a TV in each room. <laughs> it's free place, water. This place is so nice. Um, we take in here. This is it's a two bedroom apartment. And each bed is a uh, is a double. Looks like about a queen. Um, so we're we are gonna have to bunk up. Each one is a walk-in closet, which is sick. You know, it really pays uh, to have a dad who has hookups. And my dad's my dad's in real estate, which is how we got this place because we got this place for free, uh, which is sick. He just so happened to be closing a deal with the guys who own this place, so they hooked him up. So that's really sweet. Um, Huge bathtubs, apparently. Everybody's got their own bathroom. I think we have, do we have three bathrooms? We have two. Oh, two. One in there. One there and, wait, and didn't, one. no, I think it's three. No, it's the same bathroom, dude. Oh, two no, doors. No, no way. I don't understand the concept of multiple weird. entrances into one room. Uh, I don't know, but yeah. All right, we can do our laundry if we wanted. We're not gonna be around long enough for that. But if we really wanted to, we could, and a, Slightly less impressive closet. At the closet sucks. Yeah, I think uh, I think are you and Mob out bunking together still, then? Uh, uh, maybe. All right. Yeah, we still don't know what our roomy situations are, but I don't. Personally, I'm not really fussed. I can really sleep. You know what I mean? I can sleep with anybody. Um, I just love sleeping with dudes. God, we got a full kitchen and shit. Um, I'm gonna be cooking breakfast tomorrow because I cook breakfast like a fucking champ. We don't have any. Shit um, to cook, we don't have anything nice. to cook. We need to find a supermarket first of all. Oh, I, I um, maybe we could go ask John. We could ask the guy at the desk. Is he a concierge? That's what it said. It said he was a concierge on that. Do you have on key? that. Thing. Uh, yeah, but we got my key didn't work. First, yeah, we got some knives and shit. I'm making ice. We got knives. I'm gonna kill somebody just because the knives are free. I don't know how to make ice. The, are you serious? 
<laughs> we have the ice, no, he's we have kidding. The ice maker at home. Why is this locked? You fill it up, you put it in the freezer. Yeah, but, uh, no, I don't want to add too much, but there'd just be one big ice cube. <laughs> yeah, but you don't really have to sweat it too much. Because when you when you shake it, when you or when you twist it, it breaks them up. Breaks them up. I don't know how thick these walls are. I don't know if we should be doing this now. Uh, yeah. No, we're fine. Really? Yeah. You think? It's gonna be too well. Yeah, I mean, like, not screaming, but we are. We're very excited, obviously. We're on the 10th floor. Let me see if we can get a uh, good view. Here's, uh, here's a view of one of the many tunnels of Boston. This shit just goes under the city. You drive around under the city. It's like a subway, but for traffic. And uh, driving in those things sucks if you don't know where you're going because um, you lose your GPS signal. And we found that out the hard way. It took us like, even though we were off the highway and everything, it still took us another like 20 minutes to get here because I kept oh, getting yeah. lost. Oh, what is it? Yeah. That's uh, another lesson for. Oh, dude, we got a vacuum and shit. Are you fucking kidding me? This is so blasted. Deluxe apartment in the sky. We got bathroom. That's eh, a decent size. What are you talking about, big tub? This is like a normal size. No, it's the one in California. Which oh, oh, yeah. These sit these same guys. Um, was it called Oakwood there too, or is yeah, that just Oakwood. named? Oh, okay, Oakwood. Like the uh, Oakwood Apartments. My brother. Um, when he went to BlizzCon, my dad also hooked him up with a place there. I need to travel more if my dad can get me places. <laughs> nah, I'm not, I'm not talking. I'm not talking about taking advantage of my daddy like that. So we got some dishes and shit. This is classy. Okay. All right. If anything else goes on tonight, I'll let you guys know. But uh, I think for now, I'm just gonna sign out. And uh, I think I might just be going to bed. And the convention starts tomorrow. It's Thursday night. We made it. We made it here in like six hours, which is really not good because uh, yeah, Easter Sunday or Easter Sunday is this weekend, so uh, traffic was really bad. But I will see you guys probably tomorrow. Take it easy. All right, internet. We just woke up. Well, like an hour ago. And I tried making breakfast, but uh, let me teach you guys a lesson about cooking that I just learned today so that you can learn vicariously through me. Uh, country crock spread you cannot cook with. The original spread, I think the margarine you can, which is what I thought we bought, but we bought the spread. It's not butter, it's not margarine, whatever it is. It just made this, well, it's got soap in it, so you can't see it now. It just basically turned into molasses in the pan and started smoking. Luckily, we didn't set off a smoke alarm. We're about to go try to find breakfast somewhere since the food thing didn't work out on my end. And uh, then we're going to the convention center. <laughs> Last stop, bitch. We have to find a new conductor every day. Sometimes they make it back to shore. Look, like you can actually see the piers. We're on our way. We're crossing the bridge now. This Look, is, um... I can wait, see what's the name of the street again? Uh, Summer. Summer, Summer, Summer Street. Summer street. We're crossing the Summer Street Bridge over to the uh, sure convention center. Other. It's not too far from here. It's like over there somewhere. But like more that way. I don't know. Have yet. Okay, uh, I ran out of memory for a second there. I had some old videos that I was able to delete, and we are going to get into the exhibition hall. Um, just due to all the footage I took yesterday, I don't have that much internal memory. I dropped down my resolution, should be able to take a bit more. 720 is fine. I'm going to render this out to 720 anyway. What do you guys care about resolution? You guys don't give a shit about that. Anyway, we got Fem Shit. And uh, I don't even know if I actually got her on the screen. I wasn't, I wasn't looking at the preview. We're just in the line right now, nothing exciting. I will let you guys know. I'm probably only gonna take video. I'll take lots of pictures, but I'm only gonna take video when actual good stuff is happening because I'm working on limited space here. Once I meet up with the other KB mod guys, then I will definitely start a video because we're gonna Nighthawk. now because my camera died. It refuses to save any files. It's awesome. So I'm just gonna record on my camera. Maybe when I get back to the hotel room I can fix my uh, my camera. Or on my phone I mean. Maybe I can uh, fix my camera. I don't know. I'll let you guys know.
Boston. I took a picture of the boat. Now that doesn't say Boston. I don't know what the hell does. Irish pub sitting on the water. Named Whiskey Priest. I think that's what we're gonna eat. It doesn't. Yeah, it actually looks like uh, it's not too packed. <laughs> These guys go to a uh, to a pub at what is it like two two thirty in the afternoon and uh, order an Irish car box. <laughs> play that we're about to get into the beta so um when i get home you guys will probably see some uploads of that from me maybe you guys will get a break from pokemon for a second and uh yeah i'm looking forward to it i'll let you know how it is all right guys uh we're just about wrapping up the day here it's about six o'clock, so the expo, uh, expo hall. I'm tired, you can't tell, and we've had a few drinks. Um, the expo hall is closing, so Vin and I are out of here. Um, don't know where the others are. We kind of split up. We have a lot of people with us, so we're not all traveling as one big group. It's just too hard on the uh, con floor. So um, we decided to. Now, let me give you guys a tip. If you ever go to PAX, or I, I can't say for anything other than PAX East, but the past two years of PAX East. We didn't even bother with the swag bags right away. You want to wait in line for like two hours to get a freaking swag bag, you can. But what we did both times is at the end of the first day you go. And that way, they're not sold out. They're not sold out, but they haven't given them all away. And you don't have to wait in line for like 12 years. So that's pretty much uh, the end of our day for now. We're going home. I don't think we're doing anything exciting tonight. Uh, I'm going to lift. I'm going to lift. I'm not going to do shit. I'm going to sit around. I'm, uh, I'm probably going to type some stuff up. On my compi, and uh, you know, try to try to prepare some KV mods. I've got a little bit of info. There's not too many PC games that people are really looking at uh, these days, but um, Shoot Many Robots just came out on PC today. That's really fun. It's really fun. It, they adopted it, uh, adapted it, I should say, to PC really well. Um, and we got to play uh, Firefall. And there's, there's a lot of MMOs. It's all MMOs. It's uh, I forget what the one is called, but I just got a beta key for it. Um, Got into the beta for Firefall, which is kind of MMO-like. It's an, it's like an MMO shooter. It's a it's a shooter with MMO elements. And uh, Secret World, is, they're showing off a lot here, which I'm pretty excited for. Less so now that I know it's being published by EA. But. What's up, Internet? It is now Saturday morning. We're about to get started on day two of PAX. Right now, we're just waiting for the Tune Boy to get out of the shower, and we're just bumming around in the uh, in the apartment. These guys are playing Tiny Tower, which really makes me wish I had a decent phone so I could play it. Is that on Android? I assume it's on iPhone, too. It's, I think it's on Windows. Yeah. Nothing is on Windows Phone, which is fine because my phone can't run anything anyway. Let's see what we got in the swag bag, because we didn't do a break. I was going to do like a like a day in review kind of thing yesterday, but we all got drunk instead. Swag. So, what do we got? We got an ad for Gunner Optics. Get your hands out of my swag bag. Swag! You're not helping. I don't know what the fuck this is. Uh, this is like a paper craft thing. Got a Magic 2013. Hat. Oh, thank you, Ben. I got a hat to go on my hat, so I can hat while I hat. I haven't blinked in a while. Josie. Rich just took some eye drops. <laughs> some mysterious eye drops that he doesn't know what they're for. Swag! Yes. Swag. Yes. Fuck this. Yes. 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 It's not going on anytime soon. Is this? Oh, I thought this was a thing for break. Win prizes at Intel Gaming on Twitter. I'm not reading that. Win fast and present. It's a donut. That's actually pretty sweet. 
It's a uh, Donut Cop food fight. Oh, is this a new game? Oh, it's a oh, I iOS game. Oh, I missed. Let's see. What the hell? Rise of the Duel Masters. There's some, like, Yu-Gi-Oh thing going on here. It's got a pin. Alright. You got a ton of free pins. Pins are all free. Free copy of Rise, which... You mean Rift? Yeah, Rift. Swag! Swag! Which nobody wants. Empty Dungeons and Dragons bag. Probably use that for your 20-sided dice. Yeah, my man. Here's the magic card that you get. What the fuck is this? Gamersaloon.com. Yeah, absolutely not. Swag. Uh, Explosion Man, and I assume Miss Explosion Man on the on the opposite side. Oh, this is just an ad for all the uh, Twisted Pixel games. Yeah, for their booth. Yep. Uh -oh. Ooh, free copy of Magica. Which I actually. More fucking swag. I already have that game. Yeah, but give it to someone. So sexy. Can give it to someone. Get that swag. Get Manchu. Get Manchu. Yeah. There's Manchu. Oh, Manchu. Swag. No, do some dance moves, boy. I guess this is the thing for Fable Heroes. Yeah, I can't wait to do that. Shot. Yeah. Mother motherfucking Fable Heroes. One, if you play, you play it from one to two o'clock, and you beat the devs. You get a T-shirt, and if you get the high score, you get a free console. And it fucks you up. Uh, and Magic the Gathering, which I don't play anymore. But you got a whole deck. I Look got that. Soren Markov's deck. Yeah. Yeah, they yeah, give me a whole deck. Oh, that's in the swag bag. Yeah, swag bag. Yeah. And, yeah. I, and I got the swag bag itself. Yeah, I'm like Gambit. Yeah. Look. Fucking swag. Yeah. Man, that was deadly. Fucking swag. Alright, internet. See Chris out. We are now at uh, Saturday, PAX East. We're at Saturday. We're at Saturday. <laughs> we made it. And uh, I actually got lost again on the way. But. <laughs> Let me, uh, let me introduce you to some folks. We got some of these beautiful faces that we met up with. And then we gotta go all the way down here for this guy. <laughs> so, finally met up with the cave, my guys. Couldn't find him yesterday. And uh, now we're gonna, hey, Saria! Hey, we saw you at Dunkin' Donuts. I love your costume. Oh, hey. Hey, it's very nice. I was whistling the Saria's theme in the in Dunkin' Donuts meeting in the air. I didn't actually. <laughs> really? <laughs> Are you video okay. Yes, I am, if that's okay. I'm like, are you taking a picture? I, I just so happen to be recording a vlog. Uh, that's good, that's good. I like the show, I really like, I really appreciate the showmanship. <laughs> Alright, we're headed over to uh, see Garretson. Hopefully he's here. Maybe, uh, maybe John's hanging out, we don't know. So we just played a little bit of Blacklight Retribution. Uh, there was a little bit of a uh, competition going on. It was like a death match, and if you top frag, you get to come back later and play against everybody who top fragged in all the different rounds. And uh, if you win, you get a solid state drive. I did not win. I was dealing with some. I some, won uh, yesterday. Did you? Not a drive. Nah. Uh, yeah, entered in. Yeah, so you got entered in. That's yeah. sick. Well, I'm really bad at, at setup changes, so the keyboard and mouse really messed me up. So I'm I'm glad with what I did anyway. Jared is here. Jared's playing right now. Thank you, Jared. <laughs> His beard is looking magnificent. It's even better in real life. <laughs> The, the camera does not do it justice, actually. So, once you just see it, see it in real life with your own eyes, you can never go back. We finally met up with John. We went back to the Blacklight booth. We also just played uh, some, uh, not Dino Beatdown, but um, what was that called? Primal Carnage. Primal Carnage. Uh, I got a bunch of info on it, except apparently the name. <laughs> Photo bombing me? I think Fenton's photo bombing me. <laughs> wow. That is that's actually kind of an impressive photo bomb. You just like pulled off like a fucking snake. I was like I was like Neo right there. We met up with John, we met Natters, uh C Natters, and I think they're coming with us to play Midnight Combat Golf or Midnight Golf I don't Simulation know. Midnight Midnight Golf Club Midtown like Zombie uh, Simulation. Golf, golf mind fun. Yeah, that one. Okay. We're at a place called the Sunset Grill and Tap, and they have a shit ton of beer. 
And apparently, that is the yard. And I think Mama and Trun are gonna get one. Did I, introduce, did I introduce you guys to Kate? I don't think I have. We met up with her today. And then after this, we're going to the uh, Twitch.tv and Rooster Teeth oh, and I think Intel party. I don't know. <laughs> They didn't do car bombs, but uh, they did come up with something else called a uh, statutory grape. Which we are about to do. Sitting in the hotel room, waiting for some people to show up so we can go to this VIP party. You go to the game, bro? You go to the Bruins game? Tristan and Mama are already really drunk. I want to fuck you. We're going to the death party, internet. <laughs> What's up, Internet? Uh, we are in a cab now. We are just headed home uh, from the VIP party. John got us into the VIP um, after party for Twitch and Rooster Teeth. And uh, I think uh, tries to send all kinds of crazy stuff. I just went up and introduced myself to a bunch of people. I'm drunk as hell right now. We're just headed home. This good man is going to take us home. So, um... Vin and uh, Maba and Tristan and all of them headed back early. Uh, I think, or I think they went to a strip club or something. I don't know what they're doing, but uh, we're gonna head home. It's been a good day. I met a lot of good people, and I'm about ready for bed. So, you guys take it easy. All right, what's up, internet? I just wanted to uh, make a little vlog, let you guys know that I am okay. I made it back safe and unraped. Uh, I am, if you cannot tell drunk as fuck right now um john just got all of us kb mod guys in uh to like the vip section in the twitch after party twitch and rooster teeth and uh rise fucking all those guys excuse me while i take my shoes off um and uh they were free drinks i was fuck i left a huge tip for the bartenders fucking crazy like the people I met tonight you wouldn't even believe like people that I'm thinking I got no business with I mean I sat there and just chilled with C-Nanners like it was no big thing fucking Garrett from Mega 64 the Mega 64 guys were really funny really cool um, fucking Jack from Rooster Teeth I just walked up and introduced myself that's just what I do I mean Fuzzy and Sam they were there you know I walked up and said hey I'm Black Light Attack, this is me in real life. And, you know, they're like, ah, oh, Black Light Attack, you know. Really cool people, really cool people um, that, you know, I feel overwhelmed. I feel very honored that I got to meet all these people. I mean, not to mention just John and Dan and, and Mike and, you know, all, and, uh, and Chez. Chez was there. Tetra Ninja was there. Fucking everybody was there. It was crazy. I mean, that's my day in review right now. Again, I'm drunk as fuck. Water. Got some water before I go to bed so I don't get a hangover. Probably get a hangover anyway because there are like a fucking lot of beverages tonight. And it's my tip for you young guys who are just starting to drink. I know I can't discourage you from drinking. But if you're going to drink, before you go to bed, drink some water. And it will do a huge amount towards stopping you from getting a hangover. Hangover happens because you are dehydrated. And if you hydrate, you can kill that shit before it happens. But, yes, there were a lot of good people there tonight. A couple people I missed. I heard Sark was there. I didn't get to see him. I heard uh, Gerritsen was there. Maybe I misinterpreted that, but I think Gerritsen was there. Maybe he pieced out or was on the lower level or something. I don't know. 
but it was crazy. I got VIP status. I was just sitting there like I was one of the big boys, just walking up, introducing KB Mod. Um, Garrett from Mega64 actually seemed very interested in KB Mod, asked me for a card. Luckily, I had one, I didn't have any card maids, uh, any cards made, but Dan did. And luckily, Dan handed me one to give to the um, Shoot Many Robots guys, and I forgot. Um, so I still had it in my pocket. Garrettson, uh, not Garrettson, sorry, uh, Garrett asked for a card for Mega64, and I was more than happy to give it to him. Uh, really great guy. You know, I was joking around with him. I was like, yo, man, your dreads. Your dread, uh, G uh, Garrett, for those of you who don't know, is the guy with the dreads. I was, uh, I was like, oh my god, your hair, man. Can I touch it? And he was like, yeah, give it a squeeze. I squeezed and told him I needed to change my pants. So, fucking cool guy. Really funny guys out there. But I'm going to go to bed, guys. I'm going to drink my water. As I said, remember, you young guys who uh, don't know what you're doing with drinking and stuff, drink your water. I'm going to go to bed because I'm drunk as fuck. You guys have a good night. That's Saturday in review. Peace out. Seacrest out. Alright, what's up internet? Sunday morning, noon, I don't know. What time is it guys? Uh, I don't know, we all got pretty fucked up last night. I didn't. Uh, except for Richard because he's underage. Um, he was hanging out with Kate and her boyfriend. And and Mosin, who you guys didn't meet, but hopefully you will one day. Um, I was getting lots of free drinks in the VIP, and then these guys went to a strip club. Wait, you didn't go to the strip club? Huh? Uh, he was in the VIP. Uh, he was in the uh, VIP area. I was getting free drinks all night. Oh, uh, I thought you got free drinks and strip strippers. No, nah, we got strippers. Nah. Okay. So we're headed back to the convention center now. We're gonna take a taxi. Um. I'm not I'm not hungover. I'm just like really tired. Water. I told you guys, water. What is up, Internet? We just made it home. This is going to be the last vlog, uh, wrapping everything up. I would have recorded more on the way back, but we were all just so beat, and everybody was sleeping whenever they weren't driving. Vin and I drove back uh, in shifts, and uh, I drove the last leg. It was... we were all just dead. No room for jokes, no room for nothing. But um, I really didn't get as much footage as I'd hoped, but um, you know, I was, I was very busy um, just experiencing everything and I, I didn't really want to ruin that by whipping out the camera and, uh, and trying to save everything. I just wanted to live it um, as it was coming and I don't regret that. Um, hopefully by next year that, that sense of all will have worn off so that I can get you guys in on the fun a little bit more, but I hope you guys uh, do enjoy the footage I did take. Um, I didn't really get to record at the the uh, the party in the club uh, last night, Saturday night, because um, well the music was really loud and it was really dark in there. You guys wanted to be able to see or hear anything anyway, but I was up there in the VIP. John got me and Dan and Mike and uh, I think a few other people into the VIP. Uh, Chez was there and. Um, 
I met a lot of people that uh, you know made made me think that uh, I had no business with them. Um, and I, and it wasn't only just the people there. I met a lot of great people this weekend. I mean, obviously I met Dan and John and and uh, Chez and Mike and Nick. Um, and then uh, you know other than KB Mod Bros. Um, and I'm sorry if I'm missing anyone, but I met. Garrettson, I met Justin and Sam. I met, um, I met Garrett from Mega Sixty Four. I met Jack from Rooster Teeth. I met C Nanners. Um, and I don't mean like I sat down and talked with C Nanners for a minute. I mean like we were chilling in the club, just like having a conversation. C Nanners is a very cool man. I'll tell you that right now. He's a very chill dude. Um, he's not. I don't. I don't know why, but I always got the impression maybe I just because he's a little less outgoing than some of his, um, some of his coworkers. Uh, I thought that C Niners might be a bit more standoffish with people, you know, who approached him and said like, oh, you know, I'm a fan of your work. But no, he is totally an engaging guy, very friendly. I'm sure if you're at a con and you see him, you walk up and say hi. He will gladly introduce himself and say hi. Um, really, a fantastic guy. Um, all these guys were fantastic. Um, I met Tetra Ninja. I met, um, you know, a lot of developers. Um, just a ton of people and and a lot of these people um, you know uh, are a lot of them like like some of the really big guys uh, C Niners Jack and Garrett um, these guys are people who have accomplished a lot whereas I have accomplished nothing which is why I say I felt like I didn't belong there but um, the key to it was was when I saw them I walked up to them and I introduced myself anyway because one day I plan on accomplishing as much as them. I know I'm going to one day, so you gotta start somewhere. Oh, I also met Nikasor from uh, the LOL Showcase. She's very cool. Brief conversation, but anyway, guys, this will be my final vlog for PAX East 2012, and I had a blast.